everybody, welcome back to Play With Harry's Toy Channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing everybody how to draw this super cute peach character inspired by a notebook. In my last video, we drew the apple character. Please check that video out. You can go to my channel and find that video. And then, before we get started drawing our peach character, which is over here, I'm going to show you guys this other notebook. The other, last week when I went to the store, I saw another version of these notebooks, so I decided to get it. This one's super cute. It's a cafe, and this little guy riding his bicycle. It's super duper cute. At the back, there's still the same characters. And yes, let's get started drawing our peach character. These two notebooks are probably the same. A little bit different, the scenery. Let's see. But the characters are different on it. And yes, let's get started now. I hope you enjoy. And let's start drawing. Okay, guys, so this is... Um, um, so yes, we're going to start drawing now. My notebook is right here. Drop my pencil. Okay. So this is last time I drew this apple fruit character. I'm right next to a window right now. Right, right here. So this is the apple fruit character I drew last time. Um, yes. So now let's start by drawing. I'm going to be using a pencil. If you want, I recommend using a pencil because today's drawing is going to be a little bit harder than usual because of the size of the head and the shape. So that's why um, I recommend using pencil, but if you feel comfortable with using a marker, of course you can too. Okay, so now let's first start by drawing um, a circle, a small circle, like this. So this is a good size circle right here because the head is going to be around it. So it's going to be like a double time shape. So now let's draw the inside details. She has a hair for her, like this for her hair. And then let's draw her eyes actually. Her eyes are just two little simple dots. Them more round and a slight smile. They don't have really big smiles. And then let's give ourselves maybe like a point because we can. Okay, so here's my point, and I'm going to draw a shape like a wave, sort of like. And then I can finally go around it and draw a circle shape. So there, this is her head. This top of it, it's a bit small. This. Like that. Later, when we're coloring, you could act, if, it's, if you think it's too small, you can make the head bigger a bit. I'm going to do that because I think I made it a bit small. Anyways, let's draw its body. It has two pieces of leaves right here. And then let's start. So for the arms, this one's a bit hard. Um, we're going to first go have a straight line out. And then we're going to curve it back in a little bit. Don't do it all the way back up here. Just slightly. Then separate the hands. And then we're going to go straight down like this. So this is how it looks like right now. 
I'm gonna do the same on the other side. Um, and then I'll curve it, but not all the way. Draw a line and straight down, like this. So this is a good size for the body, and then we can go down more, but down to where it ends. Like this, this is so cute actually. And then now let's go ahead and draw the pants. The pants are not very, you know, they just go up and then they just go this way. This is how it, sh it looks like right now. Um, and then our feet. So this is, was actually a bit simple, actually. Um, this, this was a bit simple, so it probably only takes a few minutes to draw. The head size was a bit hard, I think. But yes, now let's color it. Um, I'm going to do this. Let's see. This is going to be a fast forward clip, but at the end, I'll give you guys another close up to show you. And yes, I'm going to do a fast forward clip of me coloring. Well guys, that was it for today. This That was it for the drawing. It turned out, I think it turned out really cute. I'm sure yours will be very cute too. Um, it looks really cute. So yes, I used a lot of pink colors um, and a little bit of green color because, you know, about the skin, about the skin, yes. And that's, basically what colors I used. A, lot, a few shades of pink and one color of green and a zebra um, black marker pen. Um, trace the work so it's, you can see it more clearly. So yes. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Click that subscribe button and I'll see you next time. Bye!